Welcome everyone. So today I will be talking about my favorites for the month of November. I know it's December the 3rd so I'm kind of late. Just a few days but I wanted to go ahead and get this out for you because I haven't done a favorites in forever. So if you would like to see what my favorites are for the month of November which is Scorpio season please keep watching. All right, so we're going to start off with the Benefit Brow Powder. Absolutely love this powder. It just takes my brows to another level. I don't even know if they sell this anymore. I actually got this on clearance at Ulta. So I was really happy that I saw it because I've been wanting it for a while, but I just never picked it up. And I'm in the number five. I'm going to try not to you know, twist and turn in this chair, but no promises. I'll do my best. So the next favorite is my Pure and Gentle Makeup Remover Wipes that I got from Walmart. I get these pretty much, I try to get these every time that I go to Walmart. They're only like 96 cents, very cheap, but they are very, very good at taking off makeup. Um, it doesn't, I don't, let me see, what am I trying to say? I don't break out or anything. These are not very harsh to my skin, um, which I can appreciate because some makeup wipes that I've used before just, it wasn't good for my skin. Um, I had like an allergic reaction to them. So ever since I've started using these, which is over a year now, I've talked about these or showed these in my previous videos. Um, but I really stand behind these wipes. Love them. And a plus is they're really cheap. So, great. My next product is actually a product that I picked up out of my Ipsy um, bag. I get a monthly, per I'm going to say monthly prescription, a monthly subscription um, through Ipsy. And you get to pick items that you want to purchase and items you know that you want to try out and this was in one of my I think it was in my either September or October um, bag but anywho this is the Tarte Shape Tape um, setting powder and the color translucent I love this powder it's actually become a really holy grail product for me for a setting powders love 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 it doesn't leave a white cast it's not really harsh or dry to the skin love this powder so if you're looking for a new powder I highly recommend the Tarte Shape Tape setting powder this right here has truly become um, what am I trying to say this is a oldie but goodie um, bronzer it's a matte bronzer by NYX or NYX I put this down for over a year and I just randomly got this off clearance at Target. It was only $2.50. Really pretty. It blends out good. It's a perfect color for me. I just love this. And it's really cheap. Well, obviously it's cheap. I got it for $2.50. But normally the regular price is really cheap too. So I love that. This is Hocus Pocus. This is Gather Around Sisters palette. This is one of ColourPop's limited edition um, collections. Anybody that knows me knows that I love Hocus Pocus. It's my number two Halloween movie. My number one is, oh my gosh, why am I drawing a blank? The Worst Witch. Came out in the 80s. I don't know if you guys know about The Worst Witch, but it actually came on HBO. They actually have a Netflix series now on The Worst Witch. But anywho, this is Hocus Pocus. I'm getting off track. And this is what it looks like. It's so pretty. ColourPop has really great shadows. They blend good. They're very pigmented. I actually used 
pretty much for these colors today on my eyes and it's actually all these colors here actually there's five colors but yes this whole row I used on my eyes today love this palette it's no longer available but just know very good the next product is the BH Chocolate Marshmallow Truffle Blush Palette and I picked this up at Ulta and this is what it looks like. I have these colors. I pretty much um, mix all of these colors together but very pigmented. It blends good. You really need a soft hand because I can get a little heavy handed so I have to make sure that I blend out my brushes my brushes blend out my blush really good oh sorry so anywho love this palette i highly recommend it and you can pick it up at ulta very inexpensive or you can go to bh cosmetics and pick it up as well the next two products i use actually together sorry i use together this is my face moisturizer along with my SPF sunscreen and I use these together really love them makes my face really hydrated even though the sun's not out or anything like that I still like using SPF on my face um, I'm not trying to get skin problems later in life so I use these two together very good my next product is also an oldie and a goodie. This is the MAC Concealer, Studio Concealer. And as you can tell, I really need some more. But I use these to get my brows together. I don't know if you can really tell, but I use this to define my brows. So, love that. Speaking of concealers... These are two new concealers that I absolutely love. It's from Juvia's Place. I use the number nine in, with this. They're a pair. So this is the LA Pro Concealer in the color orange. And then this is the color nine from Juvia's Place. I use these two together. They're in a great relationship. I use these to get rid of these dark circles and dark spots on my face. Love this too. They're a very, very good couple. And then I use the number 12 to highlight my face. And it has a doe foot applicator. It's pretty thick as far as the wand, but very good concealer. Definitely use this all the time. Now, since we're going to talk about brows... I also love the Precisely My Brow in the number 4.5 and I also like the Brow Micro Filling Pen. This is really new to me, the Micro Filling Pen. So I use this at the beginning of my brow and I use this to get my brows together to shape them. It's a really skinny pencil but it does the job. I used to be a very... Um, good customer to Anastasia Beverly Hills which they do have a very good brow products too but I really love the um, benefit um, cosmetics brow products so this all together gets my brows looking perfect almost perfect but yeah love these products and next I will be talking about MAC Cosmetics. So of course if you've been watching me for a while you know that I love MAC and their products. So along with the con whoop! along with the concealer, I love their pencils. So my favorite eye coal eyeliner pencil, of course, is Smolder. Love, love, love. It's very pigmented. It lasts very good on my eyelid or my waterline very good and then I love what is this the chestnut lip liner I'm not wearing it today but I am using cork which comes in second 
far as lip liner pencils, but my favorite of all time will be Mac Chestnut. Very good brown. Actually, let me swipe. So this is Chestnut, very pigmented. And then this is Cork, just a lighter brown. I'm not really sure if you can see that, but very smooth when applying. This is a newbie to me, is the MAC Extended Play Giga Black Lash Mascara. I've been wanting this forever, but of course, you know, mascara, I have a lot of those, so it wasn't, it wasn't on my radar for a while, but I actually got this free, um, with the free purchase at Ulta, so, yay. Anywho, it has a skinny wand, I don't know if you can tell, don't mind my elbows, but Love this mascara. I actually used this on my bottom lash. I tried it on my top lash. Eh, not so much, but who cares? All right, so I had to change SD cards. I'm not really sure where I left off, but I know I was showing you my products. So the next product is going to be from Juvia's Place. We're going to backtrack a little bit. This is the Lux, Luxy Liner and Cola. Very pigmented. And this is brown. This comes in second place as one of my favorite lip liners. So, moving on, we're going to talk about this Unicorn Essence Skin Enhancing Antioxidant Serum by Frisali. Love, love, love. It brings hydration to my skin. And I actually use the Smashbox Vitamin Glow with it as a primer. So these two are also in a relationship. And I don't see them breaking up anytime soon. So yes. This is what it looks like. As a pump. And then this is what... It looks like so yeah love those two together my favorite foundation is from dose of color it's the meet your hue and I am in the color 129 this is what it looks like it comes with the pump It's very full coverage in my opinion it just blends out very very pretty excellent coverage so if you're looking for a new foundation, I would highly recommend the Dose of Colors Hue or Meet Me, Meet Your Hue foundation. And you can go to doseofcolors.com and pick it up. I love, love, love highlighting. This is one of my favorites. You can actually pick this up at Ulta or Anastasia Beverly Hills Cosmetics, but it's the Nicole Guerrero palette. It is limited edition, but they did bring it back, so I'm not sure how long it's going to be um, in stock. It's kind of messy because I've used it over and over, but yeah. This is what it looks like. My favorite out of here is Glow Gitter, which is this one right here. I'll swatch it for you. And let's put it right here. Ooh, look at that. And then my other one is Daydream, which is that one right there. It's like a peachy color. So yeah, very pigmented, very pretty. Love, love, love. All right. My next favorite is the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. This is amazing. It makes my makeup last all day. And it brings back that moisture in your skin that you use, that you lose when you're um, putting on a bunch of powders and whatnot on your face. But yeah, love, love, love. Um, yeah. Pick this up at Ulta or Urban Decay. I feel like I'm rushing. Let me chill. Slow it down. 
All right. The next product is Pixie Skin Treats. My mom actually bought this for my birthday. And it's a Jasmine and Lavender Dreamy Dream Y Mist. It's an overnight um, spray mist. But I put this on every time I moisturize at night after I take a shower. And then I put lotion on and then I'll spray my face with this. It smells so good and it brings moisture back to your face um, on top of the lotion and whatnot. Let's see, what else do I have? What am I missing? Hmm. Well, I think that's it as far as makeup products. Now, excuse me, we're going to move over to my favorite snacks, which is the best part. So, I'm going to start off with m and It's my favorite. Love, love, love. Me and my mom, we be tearing these up, especially at night watching TV. So, favorite snack. And also, not a lot of people eat these, but I love them. And they are candy corn. I'm actually going to eat one now. Mm. There's nothing like some good old candy corn. Oh yeah, and they have to be from Brock's. And my favorite drinks are the Market Side Mango Lemonade and the market side raspberry lemonade they actually have a blueberry um, lemonade which is delicious i picked these up at walmart in the deli section they're a dollar each these are delicious i'm hooked and yeah i have nothing negative to say so if you're looking for new juices i highly recommend the market side mango lemonade and raspberry lemonade and if you see blueberry then i suggest you get blueberry as well but yeah favorite 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 and that can oh nope i was about to say that concludes look at my free bag that i got when i made a purchase at ulta it says brow queen by benefit cosmetics but it reminds me of a doctor's bag like in the old days so nice so you clamp it so pretty love 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 and it holds a lot of makeup too so yeah that no, I'm not done. God, Keeney, get it together, girl. Okay, this is a mess, but this is the AOA A Plus Super Strip Lash Adhesive. It's kind of filthy, sorry. It's been in my makeup bag and just, yeah. Anywho, love this lash glue. I took a break of Duo because I've been using Duo for years. So I wanted to take a little break. And it only cost a dollar at Shop Miss A. And then the Essence Shine Shine Wet Lip Gloss. That's what I'm wearing today. Very moisturizing on the lips. And it has a little shine. And a little tint of brown. Yeah love 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 and one more thing my handheld fan you can pick this up off of amazon mm. drives dries your makeup really really fast so pick it up at amazon so this concludes my November favorites. I think I had a good amount of stuff, but I truly do love each and every one of these products. And I really do recommend them. 
I'm not really sure if you can find candy corn anymore, but if you can, go ahead and pick it up. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. And for myself, I am going to take off this makeup and chill for the remainder of the day, watch a little Hallmark, Christmas movies, maybe Disney Plus, I don't really know. Netflix really has really good movies on there as well. So yeah, I appreciate each and one of each and every one of you watching my videos. Yeah, I really do. And you will have more videos. Well, you'll have more videos soon to watch, but I will be filming more videos. And yeah, thanks again. Please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Go ahead and share my video with your friends, your family, your coworkers, whomever you desire. And I will see you on my next video. Peace out.